This is that once in a lifetime. Welcome to my channel. So today we will be making our own Spotify plate. So to start off, these are the materials needed. Double sided tape, a pair of scissors, paint marker, bond paper, photo paper, and of course, our photo frame. Now for the template, you can just go directly to your Spotify app and screenshot the song that you want to put into your plate. But if you don't have the app, you can just browse it from Pinterest. After finding the song from Pinterest, just click download. Now this part is optional, it's up to you if you want to put a code to your song or not. After finding the code, just click download. Next, put the pictures all together into the Microsoft Word and arrange them to your liking, but you can also use other editing software. Don't forget to adjust the layout size of your document according to your bond paper and photo paper. This is why your bond paper, photo paper, and also your photo frame has to be on the same size to avoid difficulties when placing them. I recommend to use a ruler or a grid so that your template will be centered. Now, it's up to you if you want to put the code at the top or at the bottom. Just don't forget to crop the template before placing them. When printing, make sure to adjust the properties whether it is the photo paper or the bond paper that you are printing to avoid wasting papers. This is what it looks like after printing. This is the photo paper and this is the bond paper. Now it's time to use our photo frame. Start unwrapping the plastic of your frame and then carefully bend the lock of your frame using your scissors. Then carefully take out the glass of your frame and clean it with a cloth or a paper towel to remove the dust. Gently place the bond paper template underneath your glass and make sure to place them into the center. Now it's time to use our paint marker and start placing. For those who are asking, I bought this pen online for about 60 pesos. This marker dries really fast so don't worry about smudging. If you had a mistake when tracing, just wipe it off with alcohol and tissue paper. It will not come off easily if you just wipe it off with water because this marker is water resistant.
For this part, use a ruler to trace the line. You can also have multiple layers if you want to. Now, it's time to use our photo paper template. Just cut the photo album using a pair of scissors, but if you have shaky hands like me, I'd recommend to use a ruler and a cutter to achieve that straight line. Get your double-sided tape and place them at the very edge of the album cover. Then carefully stick the album cover to the glass. And now we're done! This is the final look of your Spotify plaque. It's up to you if you hang this on your wall or just put them back inside the frame and adding some background to it. This part is optional. You just scan the code from your Spotify app and then there you go! It can be decorative and useful at the same time. Thanks for watching! See you in my next vlog!